Uh, the, uh, the number one challenge I get from clients is around lack of time, lack of resource. Uh, you know, marketing departments are increasingly being asked to do things, you know, market across many, many more channels. At the same time, the departments are shrinking. So it's all about how can we get more stuff done? How do we do more stuff? So what we do when I'm advising clients is I, I advise them to do, um, think about marketing automation. And not just the marketing automation we all think of, the kind of the downstream automation where a customer does X and we respond with Y, um, but uh, upstream automation as well. Anything that they can do to make the process easier, anything they can automate to get the campaigns out the door. Basically, so they can spend less time in the business and more time on the business. So I think the three most common mistakes that email marketers uh, are making today are batch and blast. So they're not segmenting their data, they're sending the same thing to everybody. Um, they spend too much time focusing on the standard process metrics of opens and clicks and not enough time focusing on the metrics that matter, like revenue. And the third thing would be marketers think that permission is forever. Permission is not a puppy. Permission is not forever. If people aren't engaging with your email, they're not engaging with your brand, over time, your permission to communicate with them goes away. You know, the brands that are doing email well are the ones that are really trying to have human conversations, individual conversations, and they're doing that at scale. So they're having a slightly com different conversation with you and then, then they're having with me, then they're having with the, you know, the next person along. Those are the brands that are really getting it right. They're really, what they're doing is they're building their customer experience into their email program. They, they recognize that email is part of that customer experience and are delivering on that, that overall brand promise. So if I could uh, wave a magic wand and give, grant a wish to all email marketers or, or enforce my will, if you will, on all email marketers, it would be around transparency. We need to be transparent with consumers about why we're collecting their data, what data we're collecting, how we're gonna use it, how we're gonna store it. Consumers prefer email by more than two to one over any other channel for maintaining relationships with brands. So I think the one thing that uh, email marketers need to keep front of mind when planning their strategy is you're just having a conversation. It's too easy to start thinking about your list as data, as addresses. So what I like to say to clients is pretend that that client, that customer is in the room. They're standing there right in front of you. What would you say to them? 